version 1.0 is our socially distanced COVID iteration of uh, To Be A Machine, an adaptation of the book by Mark O'Connell, which is an investigation into transhumanism. Transhumanists are all united through thinking that the body is an obstacle that we need to overcome in order to achieve our true natures, our true selves. And of course, in the context of COVID-19, it's our bodies which are the problem. Our bodies are biohazards. And we started to think, how would the problems of social distancing complement the story of transhumanism and how we would tell that story? The show is an investigation into our relationship with technology, our relationship with our bodies, especially in the context of how disconnected we've had to be through the lockdown and yeah how maybe all we want to do is to just be together one of the wonderful things about doing something you've never done before is that there's lots to discover it's basically the whole process is a series of unknowns uh, and in this case putting together what i'm describing as a live short film means we don't know exactly uh, what effect that will have on an audience so what we have imagined for this iteration is we have an audience who, rather than being physically present in a theater, are uploading themselves into the space and we will give them a digital presence rather than an embodied one. Um, and so we're very excited to see that when we put this together in the room and stream it out to people's laptops at home, will that connection that you get in the live theater experience translate or not? So there's lots to discover. There will be some audience interaction. And again, that's, that's kind of what we're trying to look into. It's like how, what is lost when there aren't any bodies in the room. And maybe my job as the performer is to try and make the audience feel like they are there and to try and give a sense of vitality and liveness to the whole thing. In particular, we're very, very happy that the Science Gallery have partnered with us and giving us support um, and mentorship and guidance. It's a, kind of an ideal partnership to tell this story about transhumanism and technology. I'd like the audience to come away feeling like they weren't just staring at a screen for 45 minutes. Something that makes them feel alive, something that makes them feel rejuvenated in some way, excited, hopeful, and more human. Thank you.